Hey man, it's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. And look man, we got some more 2K23 news, man. We got some more gameplay leaks, some uh demo first impressions, people that played the game talking about it, and some more leak ratings, man. So make sure y'all watch this full video, drop a like, it helps out the vid a lot. Subscribe if you're new, and um, yeah. So 2K Intel tweeted this out. We're gonna talk more about this later, but y'all let me know y'all's favorite builder down below, okay? Okay, so let's see what Scotty Barnes has to say about um, his experience playing 2K23, man. 23 good. Oh, he's rubbing his um, face. I have some flaws right now. Oh, he's rubbing his face. It don't, he don't seem too excited. He's like, oh, he should say, he didn't say yes, you know. Red flag, red flag. <laughs> Play now, everybody's shot was slow. Mm, everybody's shots always slow in play now. I don't think I really like the meter that much. Uh -huh. Um he confirmed that he was a bot because um um he was using the meter. Okay, that's understood. We're we're getting news from a bot, which is okay. It's okay to be a bot, it's okay to be a casual, guys. Be yourself. The defense is uh just like twenty two next gen. Uh, the Defense is like 22 next gen. Um, that's terrible. 22 next gen defense is garbage. It's way better than 22 uh current gen defense, by the way, if you didn't know. But you know, it's a little less sliding and you have a little bit more paint defense. But overall, like the D is <laughs> so all I'm hearing is red flags with this 2K23 shit, man. We can only hope, but damn, bro. No, I ain't no one talking about the positives. Y'all got flowed out. What's going on? <laughs> the movement is pretty solid. Uh, I feel like you can get more contested shots. Wait, wait, wait. What did he say? The what? What the fuck he say? Uh, the movement is pretty solid. What the fuck is he saying? Movement? The defense is uh, just like 22 next gen. Uh, the movement is pretty solid. What the fuck? Yo, y'all let me know down below what you think he's saying, bro. Solid. Uh, I feel like you can get more contested shots. More contested shots. Okay, they was probably playing on a low level, but more contested shots than 2K22 next gen, bro? That's crazy. A lot of Shakedown said that. This is crazy. This is a red flag, bro. I don't know about y'all, but I mean, they, they saying it's easy off rip. Niggas, bro, if someone can shoot OD crazy right when they first touch the game, that's a problem, bro. I, I don't I don't know. Uh like they're come on, more contested shots? That's that's crazy, bro. Y'all don't think do y'all do think that's crazy or not? Would y'all rather would y'all rather have a 2K with less contested shots? 2k 16 esque or more contested shots you know 18 19 22 esque like if it's a late closeout, late closeout. um you can hit more shots it's oh, pretty solid i was busting people's it's 2k uh, i don't know nigga where the rest of him talking about this y'all y'all send me uh the rest of him talk where did y'all even get this from 2k 22 might have been like the easiest shooting 2k ever y'all let me know what y'all think the easiest shooting 2k ever okay we got some more 2k 23 leak gameplay man okay we got the cheerleaders man y'all you know cheerleader some gameplay can't really see shit let's, let's check out the d mm. Mm. whoa <laughs> Yo, y'all know I'm just over out here. Hey, there ain't nothing else to do or upload. But, hey, he had a spam move, bro. You know, no contact on the D. You know. Oh, another red flag. Wait, hold on. He just greened a contested shot, bro. You see that shit? He just greened a contested shot, bro. It looked like somebody jumping at him. I can't see that shit, bro. Another red flag, bro. <laughs> Another red. Bro, I know some of y'all, this is like your only source of happiness. Look, 
I'm not coming at your source of happiness, bro. I'm just talking about the game. You don't have to watch my videos, bro. I'm just being honest, unlike all these other double twist gawkers about a video game, bro. It's a billion dollar company. Stop defending a video game. I don't care what changed your life. You're so it's a video game, bro. You don't have to watch me, bro. Like, come on, man. Y'all niggas are weird. Some niggas is weird, bro. He just made that contested hoe. Do you know what your rating is going to be in this year's game? Uh, yes, I do. They just told me uh, not too long ago. Tyler man. Hero? Uh, they said an 84, man. So 84? Okay, okay. Let's see what happens by the end of next year. What's it going to be by the end of the season? Y'all think he deserve an 84? Probably like an 88 or 90. Yeah, yeah, 88 or 90? Nigga, you're a cap. Y'all think that nigga cap? This nigga is crazy. Man, I was what expecting you to say 99 because I know you got the confidence. <laughs> yeah, 99 is crazy, though. I do know it now. I just heard it. Just you're going to give us the exclusive. What is it? So this is the first time I'm saying this. So this is the drop right here. I got the 84 okay. to start the year out. What's it gonna be when the season ends, though? To end the season, I'm, I'm going for the 90. Nice. Somewhere, maybe even a 91, 92, maybe if I can slip in what? there. What? I want to be at that 90 mark for sure. NBA two. Yo, this nigga crazy. Y'all let me know if y'all think he could do that. A lot of y'all are crazy. Look, so 2K Intel tweeted out the most simple builder we had, but the most balanced in my opinion. Now. 16 had one of the best builders okay i'm explaining to you why and i'm explaining to you why the builder doesn't even create balance okay first of all 16 had one of the most realistic builders okay also i know a lot of y'all be bashing 16 and stuff and why is it always you niggas that never played the game if you didn't play the game like shut up bro like stop bashing a game that you never played did y'all know that 16 had no Hall of Fame badges? Did y'all know that? Did you know in 16 there was no takeover? This is why the game was more balanced. There wasn't no like super boost of your ratings. You know, they made it more casual with the start of 17 and then 18, they made it even more casual. But before then, bro, you could guard ball yourself with your build. I mean, a lot of y'all might think hey, the 6-7 Demi Bro, it wasn't like that. It's like it is every year. In the stage, the meta for the real stage niggas, the glitchy niggas, y'all know how like people be dribbling glitchy now? The glitchy niggas that was in the stage, they ran six twos or six ones. That was the meta guard. They even tried the five eight stuff. There was a period when everyone kept making five eights, but then everyone figured out that they weren't actually faster just because they could get 99 speed or whatever. They were, cause they're so small, they only got little feet, you know? But yeah, bro, the gameplay what is what creates the balance, not the builder. I'ma say it again for you. The gameplay creates the balance, not the builder, not the ratings, okay? Y'all have no idea. The gameplay, not the ratings, cause in every game, every builder, there's always people with 99 threes, the max defense, the, all these badges in those categories, and they still can't do anything to really be effective. So it depends on the gameplay. Now, the reason this is one of the most balanced builders is because everyone can have a similar-esque build, right? To create real balance and a real skill gap, it is everyone's on the same type of build. I know everyone makes play shots and stuff. You can guard ball yourself because of the, the gameplay, you know? You got like better bump animations, better contest, and all that type of stuff. You wouldn't have to rely on your lockdown. You could guard your man yourself. It's just like the 2K League. Everyone's playing with like the same type of build. That might not be good for content, but overall, for y'all people who just play the game casually and for fun and stuff, a 16 type of game, you know, it was a little difference, but you know, you could dunk just like in real life. People like to hate on 16. You could dunk the ball just like every build can do in real life, right? You could shoot the ball just like every player can do in real life, and you could fit, you could defend just like every player can in real life, okay? This doesn't mean you had a 100 stat. Depending on how tall your nigga was and all that different type of shit, you know, it, they based it off of that. This just looks 
probably looks crazy to some people, but bar none, it had one of the best builders, and so did 2K15, bro. Despite, like, you know, the how they try to bash it with the demigods and stuff, your build could do what they could do in real life, bro. You know, 6-8s, you know, that type of stuff, running the game, bro, dribbling fast. That's how 2K should be. The best players in the world are two-way players, big boys, not little midgets and stuff. But still, the little guards need, you know, I actually liked how they added mismatch, but it's just too OP, right? But they should have an advantage, too. You know, you should have different advantages based off your heights. But, you know, big builds should run the game. But they never have in any 2K still, you know? Maybe in the park, y'all might think like the 6-7 and all that. But they didn't run like in the stage. They didn't run that, bro. Okay. I was there. Okay. I was a stage guy sensei. They ran the 6 twos, bro. 6-2s, six 6-1s six type shit. You know, Pac, he don't know what he's talking about. 20 was a terrible game. Everyone had tendencies. The legend glitch. You created super demigods and... <laughs> You know, paint beast with like fucking 40 badges to shoot. Like, come on. Look, most balanced builder was 17. No. The 6'2 speed boost and sharps and all that. Like, how was 17 the most balanced? That's where the role player stuff really began. But still, at the end of the day, you can still make builds that could do everything. Y'all just be like so clickbaited, dude. Like, like for instance, the, the true demigods, the broken shit. The stretch big is better than any build. The 17 stretch big could run point and could dex and break the game. The 17 stretch big is better than every build in 16, every build in 15, and every build in 14 broken the stretch bigs in 18 were even more broken right and then because of the paint mash and those athletic beasts are better than every build before y'all see i got this shit down to a science i was there i'm a brainiac my nigga certified genius tested boy like y'all y'all can't y'all can't out debate the swan you know the 6-2 speed boost and sharps and stuff like if you didn't have one Come on, bro. That, that shit was broke. Look, it's demigods as well. Jesus, nostalgia really has a community in chokehold. You could tell he didn't play 16. Dumbass. Like, what? what's a real demigod? A demigod is something that can do something, in my eyes, that other people, that you can't even do in real life. What? Where's the demigod in 16, bro? In 15, it broke. Once 16 came out and stuff, niggas broke the game. But that's not how 15 was played, bro. Like, for majority of the game, niggas went back to fit, you know, like, come on, bro. Y'all niggas, y'all niggas be putting smut on shit. But, nigga, what, what's a bigger demigod than the 17? Well, uh, Stretch Bigs. Huh? You tell me. Those were the best builds in the game. Then the 18 ones? The 18 ones were even better. Because with the Stretch Bigs on the twos, bro, you could only do that on the twos. You couldn't take them to the threes and do that uh, dex and shit. When 18 came out... You could then abuse them on the threes, bro. You could run three centers on the comp stage and rock nigga shit. The same with 19. They was even more OP. So those games was even more broken. But the gameplay assisted in those broken systems. Like, it, they might have looked pretty, those build systems. But you could really make super demigods out there, bitch. Like, look, it looks pretty. Look at this. It's looked like a pretty builder, you know? I think y'all are more obsessed with the aesthetics of these type of you know like builders you know i don't know bro and and another thing with the builder bro which a lot of y'all don't understand is you can make the same builds throughout all these 2ks they're just like like for instance like for instance the next gen builder is basically pie chart y'all don't even realize it's just it looks like a different system through every 2k it's like the same builder but they're just making you think it's something new and there's slight change. Y'all don't even realize it. Like it's not no like, it's slight changes to make you think it's something new, but it's really like the same type of shit. I mean, that might be hard to understand, but um, like 22 before like glitch builds came, 
it was actually more restricted than current gen, bro. Y'all didn't even realize because they started making it to where, you know, it wasn't four points for the badge. It was five, six, or seven. So it was more restricted. Y'all, a lot of y'all niggas, you say you want that shit, but now y'all say this OP when niggas figure out how to break it because they didn't test it and have no people really go out there to test the game to see, like, what's up. Like, but that's not how they intended for it to be. They wanted next gen to be more restricted, bro, than um current gen. Look, look at this. Look at this stupid nigga. My guy, there is two build worth using. A seven footer and a seven three. That's it. Super unbalanced. Like, bitch, did you play 16? Look, next gen builder. Look at this. Niggas is dumb. They didn't play the game. You niggas didn't play the game. Look, the, it worked right back then because of badges. There's a lot of new badges that like broke the game. But even even then, bro, like demigods made the game. More. What demigod? Do y'all know that's how it is in real life? Like most players are two-way players, bro. Crazy. <laughs> y'all niggas, bro. Y'all niggas be killing me, dog. N n niggas, niggas, niggas try to critique 16 or old 2K. And then they go to some shit YouTuber or before anyone figured out how to dribble and how to do meta stuff. And then they show that gameplay, bro. Just like in every 2K, there was like real stage geeks in that bit, you know, but they just didn't go on YouTube. You know, like I have some gameplay out there to where you see how niggas move, bro. Like and niggas was glitchy on that whole game was a lot faster, bro. But even though a lot of my shit got deleted, but not all my stage gameplay niggas was playing straight meta like with 15 and 16 like there's there's eras once niggas learn more and more and more just like every 2k niggas go through a cycle of then learning and evolving and then they look crazy but hey man anywho man make sure y'all subscribe if you know man i'll be covering all the 2k 23 leaks the uh best builds when the uh game come out best dribble moves best jump shots a bunch of tips hilarious toxic gameplay y'all go watch the rec vid i just dropped about my first 2k 23 build it's the funniest game <laughs> it's the funniest 2k vid you you gonna see people don't post more funny content than me but um yeah man make sure y'all drop a like and yeah Turn on them noties. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.